Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. We have a PSA submission that was just returned yesterday. 28 cards, it's all uh, gaming cards like Pokemon, Magic the Gathering, and some a few Star Wars, and then one non-sport Topps Chrome Galaxy Atomic Refractor Star Wars card. And let's see what we got. This is the lighter box, so there's probably just a few in here. I believe all of the magic cards are going to be from secret layer, different secret layer drops. Some older ones, uh, Street Fighter, and I think like the Little Rascals themed uh, Planeswalkers. One stack. And then maybe a few other cards from, um, I think there's one, like Space Godzilla foil in there. A couple Pokemon that I pulled out of a uh, video not too long ago out of some Crown Zenith tins. And some, like, four, four or five Star Wars uh, CCG from back in the day, early 2000s, that I bought. They're all foil uh, reflections from the reflection set that I bought from someone off of Macari. They look pretty good in the picture, so I figured, you know, I thought they might be nines at best. Uh, I was hoping for nines, but eights would be okay. Um, I don't know how they were put in here. And you see a big giant stack. Well, not giant, but 28 cards. Let's we'll start with the one on the, the top here. It's a, it's a magic card. And as you can see, 2022 Magic the Gathering, Soren, Grim Nemesis, Secret Lair Drop. Like I said, they're, they, they're made to look like uh, little cute little baby type or toddler type. Characters uh, with like the Little Rascals theme, I believe. I forget what the exact name of the drop was called, but this one got a Gem Mint 10. So we're off to a good start. And I believe I sent in play sets of each of these. So there should be four of him and four of everything else except for like the Space Godzilla one. So this one, this one got a nine. So we have one nine and one ten. All right, this one got a 10, so two out of three. Okay, maybe I was wrong, um, unless it's somewhere else in this pile. Because the next card is the, this is the only uh, non-gaming card. This this is my card. This is the second one. I had two of the exact same atomic refractor, just different numbering. And my thoughts are, you know, hopefully they both get 10. The first one got a 10. If this one get a ten, got a 10, I'm going to sell whichever one is the higher number in the serial number. So this is 72 out of 150. And this one also got a Gem Mint 10. So I have two Gem Mint 10s of this card, which is great. Teaching the younglings. So we'll put that over there. That's nice. That's my card. Back to magic. This is uh, Ashiok Dream Render. Another uh, Planeswalker from that set. This one got a 10. And these are all foil, by the way, the magic cards. All right, second one. This one also gemmed up 10. So we're doing really well so far. Here's, a, here's the other Soren. So there were four. And that one got a 10. So somehow they got separated. So three out of the four Sorens were 10s. Two Ashioks so far here's the third one this one also received the 10 so we're doing really well all right so here's a johnny mentor of hero heroes this one got a 10 i think there should be one more ashiok and yeah so we're missing one so we'll go back there see who this is all right here's another new one uh tamino or tamio the moon sage this one got a 10. all 
A second Tamio or Tam <laughs> yeah Tamio. This one got a nine, so that's our second nine. Here's the first Star Wars card. Now these are tough because they're black bordered, but I was like I said, I was hoping the nine. So it's a Reflections Princess Organa. This one got a nine, so I'm pretty happy with that. It's a nice looking card. I'll put the Star Wars cards over here. Back to magic. Here's another Ajani. So this one got a 10. Two for two on him. Another Ajani. Another 10. Just put Timio over there for now. So there's one more Ajani, I believe. And here it is. It also got a 10. So we have a playset of Jim Mint 10. For him, I'll separate that. Put him back there. We're still okay. Here's the other Ashiok. So there's another ten. So I believe we have a playset of. Uh, I call him her, uh, just because of the voice in the game in Arena. But this truly could be someone that's non-binary uh, or gender fluid. Because it looks like a chick, but it also kind of looks like a guy. So, who knows? We got a play set of Jim Mint 10 for, for that Planeswalker as well. Here's a, the second Star Wars card. And there's like a... It's not on the surface. It might be underneath. Anyways, the card got a grade of a 9, which is... Again, I'm happy with that. Not happy with the like scratch or whatever that is maybe on the inside of the holder or maybe it's like a dust particle or something that got encased in it it just frustrates me all right here's another tamio this one got a 10 so we were done with Soren there. There's three Sorens that were tens and then one nine. Two Tamio. Here's another Star Wars card. This is Commander Luke Skywalker. This one also got a nine. So again, I'm very happy with that. These cards are very hard to grade. All right, here's a Street Fighter Hadouken. Uh, otherwise known as Lightning Bolt. This is from the Street Fighter Secret Lair Drop. And this is a foil. And this got a 10. That's really nice. Here's the Space Godzilla uh, Death. You know what? I, I don't think YouTube likes this word. But um, this is a card that's never going to be reprinted. So we got a foil and I got it graded. And it came back a 9. So that's a little disappointing. Still a nice looking card though. The foil pops. Put that at the bottom because that's the only non like secret layer magic card I think in this submission. All right, here's the other Tamio that also gemmed. So three out of four of those got tens. This is the last Star Wars gaming card. It's my man Han Solo. And this also got a 9. So all the Star Wars cards got 9. I'm very happy with that. That was a really good purchase. Okay, here's the uh, second Hadouken. That also got a Gem Mint 10. Here's the first Pokemon card. Pokemon... SW Shield, I guess Shield and Short or Sword and Shield uh, Full Art Deoxys VMAX from Crown Zenith. This one got a Gem Mint 10. If my boy Ian were here, he'd probably be going crazy right now. When I pulled the card, he went crazy. So maybe I'll take a picture of that and text it to him. And here's the other card from that break it's another Full Art Deoxys V Star this time. And that one also got a Gem Mint 10. So that was a really good opening. The last two cards should be the last two Hadoukens. All right. And that one also gemmed up. 
and see if we can get a play set of Jim Mint 10s on these. Here's the last one. Let's flip it over, and we didn't. Ah, this one got a nine. So three out of four. Um, so let's see. I think all my nines are right here. So out of 28 cards, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight nines and 20 tens. That is pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that result. Um, it's like what 71 ish percent gym met gym rate. So yeah, that was pretty good. Let me know what you thought about the grades. Um, what you think about the cards. I think the cards look really nice. Again, I kind of picked some of the cooler looking ones. I, there are other street fighter cards. I have tons of other secret layer drop cards that I may consider submitting once they have a uh, special again. But uh, definitely my eye is getting better at picking out cards to submit with uh, the hopes of getting tens. So hopefully that keeps up. But uh, thanks for watching. Um, please hit the thumbs up button for the video and consider subscribing to the channel if you like what you saw. Till next time, good night.